And we back. I am super excited for today because we're trying to build a championship team playing the game GeoGuessr. The idea of GeoGuessr is very, very simple. You put randomly in any place in the world and you have to try to guess what city, what state, or what country you're in. And the way it's gonna work for me, if I can guess the right state we're in, I can pick a player that was born or from that state. We got some rules, y'all, because uh, I am not a pro at this. Actually, I'm not, I'm not good at this at all. So I'm giving myself a little bit of wiggle room. If we guess the state correctly, I get to pick any player that I want from that state. If I guess the state incorrectly, we're using a random number generator for them to determine what player we get from that state. And because it is difficult and there's 50 different states, if I guess a neighboring state, I'm gonna pick five different players from that state put them on the wheel and let the wheel determine which player we get. Hopefully that makes sense. And if it doesn't, you will understand once we get into the video. Leave a like, subscribe, and let's try to get the perfect NBA team using GeoGuess. All right, this is the first one already. Um, We are put in a random parking lot. Um, And this could be anywhere. <laughs> this could be anywhere. I, I know a parking lot in the suburbs of Chicago that look just like this, but maybe we could just look at the, the name of the stores. What is that? I ain't even... Okay, so this is a store I don't recognize. King? King something. Open 24 hours. That is not a place that exists in Illinois, so we can scrap Illinois out. Now, my goal is to use as many clues as I can. I see the license plate. The license plates looks very New York. <laughs> now, I don't know a lot about license plates, but New York one is one that's very significant. Now, I'm going to try to not take... 20 minutes to figure everything out because I feel like that's a that makes it a little bit easy But I'm gonna try to use every piece of clues that I, I can oh no idea no idea Actually a parking lot. is not that bad because you never really know if oh wait This is a Victoria's secret. I feel pretty good about this being New York, bro. That license pl right, I'm guessing New York. Can we get uh, the right player and then no matter where I just need to get the right state So let's say we're in Albany, New York. We are in New York, one for one. I think that's New York. It is New York, one for one. I, I think. Wait a minute. Is that New York? <laughs> I know it says New York right here. That is South Hampshire. It is Long Island, New York to be exact. So I do get to pick an NBA player from New York. All right, so here are the players we can choose from. Donovan Mitchell is here. Donovan Mitchell. Now it has to be active. I do see Carmelo would be kind of cool. But of, of active NBA players, Donovan Mitchell is the best player. So that is a great start one for one. Oh, okay. I see Arizona. I see Arizona, y'all. Now, now I've traveled across America. Now, I haven't been to every state, but I have been to Arizona. And this looks like what Arizona looked like when I was there. Now, it also could be somewhere in Texas. I think Texas kind of fits. But then again, I'm seeing like these palm. I saw some palm trees. So maybe this is SoCal as well. Um, yeah, the palm trees are here. So I I have to basically take a guess. This could be SoCal, but then again, again, the cactus. I'm going to, I'm saying we are in somewhere in like Phoenix, Arizona, baby. Can we go two for two? NBA players from Arizona. Oh, I'm locked. The highest score you can get is 5,000, and I just got 4,500. Whoo, okay. Two for two to start. Now, I told you I wasn't a pro. And I'm not, I think I, I legit just got lucky. I think, I think a lot of people watching the video is also two for two. Those were two layups if you ask. This is all of the NBA players born in Arizona? Really? So I get one right and the best player I get is Matisse Steibel or Marvin Bagley? Wow, that is low key's very, very surprising. Um, I, I guess I'm taking Marvin Bagley. Yep, I've seen a channel like this, we, we kind of neglect our uh, international NBA players, we apologize. It's just not one for y'all today. I, I think you're okay with that, hopefully. I did not know that Arizona wasn't producing NBA players. Like, you know, I think about Arizona to college and how many players they produce. I just assume that, uh-oh, is this Florida? <laughs> I just kind of assume that they're producing NBA players because, you know, they produce a lot of NBA players at the college. Some of them had to be from Arizona in my eyes. Nope. DeAndre Ayton. Of course, we knew Larry March is not there. But, like, they have a good group of NBA players that they've produced. And, yeah, I guess none of them are actually from the state. I feel pretty good about this being Florida, bro. I feel pretty good about this being Florida somewhere. I don't know anything about the architecture of Florida. I just saw those trees. And I had a feeling that we are in, uh, we're in somewhere in Miami. Oh, no. What? We are at the edge of Texas. That's crazy. I had no idea that Texas had trees like that. 
All right. I thought I was going three for three. Man, that's border. That's on the Mexican border. Wow. That's like across the street. That's insane. All right. We got to get a random player from Texas. Now, I know Texas has produced a lot of NBA players. So let's see what we got. Right now, there are 23. Now, imagine we get something wrong and we still walk out with like Trey Young. I take it. I ain't going to complain. But we got 20. I'm sorry. 31 NBA players. 31 players. We're going to get player number 18, who's Royce O'Neal. Okay, at least we got a real player. Royce O'Neal is maybe not the best option available, but at least he is a real player. I'll take that. Next place, uh, they give us the exact street name, but now this is where things get difficult. This is where things get difficult. Now, if I knew anything about area codes, I would have had it right, right here because this is something 3-2, but that doesn't tell me anything. Um, the license plate doesn't tell me anything. So let's go down the street and see this. This is a reservoir, U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. That don't tell me nothing. Clay's. What is Clay's? Clay's is a food and drink. They got crawfish. Uh-oh. Free ad, I guess. Uh-oh. Are we still in Texas? Is that what I think it is? Are we in Houston? Oh, what if this is a crazy curveball? I've been in Houston. I ain't see this. We are in Houston, Texas. That was fast. I didn't even have to really search for that. And going back to the list of guys, I see Trey Young, man. Trey Young or Tyrese Maxey. I'm taking Trey Young. Trey Young, welcome to the team. That's a dub. That's a dub. So far, we've done a phenomenal job. A phenomenal job. Okay. Now, 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 when you say everything looked the same, this could be anywhere. This could be upstate New York. This could be Charlotte, North Carolina. This can be so many different places. Um, so when I do something like this, I'm looking for signs. I'm looking for anything I can. And I don't really know what this sign means, but I know I've, I saw it a lot when I was down south. I know I saw it a lot when I was down south. I don't know what it means exactly. To tell you about the, the American school system, that flag means something to somebody to me. I have no idea. Let's go down the street for a little bit. Um, we, we have a chance to, to do something really good here. I'm thinking this is a southern state though. Georgia, maybe. You know, I'm 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 getting good vibes off Georgia for whatever uh, gas is how much? 549? Oh my god. Oh, that's for diesel. 459. It's still crazy too though. Um, okay. Do we do these signs tell us anything? Cognac? Okay, nope, they don't tell us nothing other than uh oh. Nope, nothing, nothing. Uh oh, another sign. Broken spur saddle southern states well at least that tells us that we are in the south but are we georgia are we alabama are we you know what i'm saying i'm gonna go down the street a little bit longer and see if i can get one more clue i need one more clue before i take my guess all right i can't find any clues i'm, I'm gonna take a shot at georgia i'm gonna take a shot at georgia unless this sign tells me right here give me a shot at georgia county lakes apartment and yeah that that's ugh, that number if i knew if i knew zip codes we'd be great i'm still gonna go georgia we're going to be right outside Atlanta, right here. Boom. We were in... Wait a minute. Is that Georgia? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's Georgia. This right here is Florida. We're, we're in Kingsland. We're in Kingsland uh, at Georgia. That's a dub. That's another one. Am I getting Jalen Brown? Am I getting Jalen Brown? Because I think I might be getting Jalen Brown. That is so close to the border of Florida that I'm going to double check that Kingsland, Georgia is a real place. Best believe it is. All right. All right. What Atlanta NBA player are we getting? Again, I know Jalen Brown. They got a couple. Oh, Anthony Edwards is a sh for sure on this list. Let's go to Georgia. Let's see what we got. Okay. All right. Anthony Edwards. Uh, whoa. Where's Jalen Brown? Is Jalen Brown not from at from Georgia? Hello? It says he's from Georgia. Did I just overlook him? I must have overlooked him. I had to overlook him because ain't no way. Oh, no, he is there. Okay, I was tripping. I was tripping. I am actually going to take Anthony Edwards, though. I'm going to take Anthony Edwards. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's, that's a good pick. Now, that was the first round? Y'all, we did phenomenal. We did really, really good for the first round. And over here, you can see all of that was done in five minutes. I took one minute, then 40 seconds, and 40 seconds. Don't think I'm out here really going through it. No, I'm taking quick, quick guesses. And I was right on majority of them, which is a dub. Now, I also do not think that's the norm. Let's go into round number two. Um, are my eyes deceiving me? Oh, okay, there it is, there it is, there it is. Okay. Um, I immediately got a good Philadelphia vibe from this place. I got a really good Philadelphia vibe from this one. I can't say it is Philly, but I got a really good Philadelphia vibe from this one. Um, 
Like, I'm gonna move around a little bit. I would love to get to a main road. I think that's that's the cheat code to all this. Get to a main road. See if you can see some stores. But I I I see Philadelphia. But now maybe not so much. This school is St. Anthony School. Okay, don't tell me nothing. My favorite thing is reading the comments of these videos. They'd be like, oh my God, Kenny was five minutes away from my house. That's always fun. Uh, but please don't tell the world which place I was in when I saw your house, please. <laughs> Just keep yourself safe, please. Now, nothing here is telling me to think anything other than my gut. Did, did Pennsylvania, did Philadelphia have red signs? Oh, 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 oh my God. This can help, this can help. Is this a police car? It's a police car. What'd that say? Fitchburg Fire. Fitchburg, what state is that? Fitchburg, Fitchburg. All right, I can't spend too much time. I'm gonna go with my gut and say that we are in um, near uh, Philly. I'm gonna say we're near Philly. Here we go. Ah, we were in Boston. See, Boston is a, or I'm sorry, we were in Massachusetts. Massachusetts is a state that I've never been to, so I don't have any good frame of reference. So, Massachusetts have produced 47 NBA players. How many of them are active? Um, a, phew, five? No, three? Four? Four. It's really just four. All right, here we go. Four. We're getting number two, who's Pat Connaughton. I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. I would, If I got it right, I probably would have picked Bruce Brown, but Pat Connaughton's not bad either. Okay. Not the best start to the second round. We good. Oh, my God. Now, this could really be anywhere. You threw me on a ranch? Is this a ranch somewhere? Yeah, there's not going to be a single sign that's going to help me determine where we at. How do we get out of here? I might as well just take a guess. I'm just going to say I see stuff that might be Texas. And when in doubt and it looks like the South, guess Texas. That's that's what that's what I always say. I can't even get out of this place. So I won't. I'm guessing Texas somewhere. Just anywhere in Texas. I would be completely wrong. I was in North Carolina. Or is that South Carolina? It is the border of South Carolina. You you walk 10 minutes this way, you're in North Carolina, but instead of South Carolina. And with that one, I'm not trying to single single person that's like, how could he not know that was this state? You ain't know that. You lying. South Carolina has nine different players. Some of these players I've never heard of before. He's only played five NBA games. Um, but Ja Morant, isn't Zion from South Carolina? Hold on, why is Zion not here? He's from South Carolina. Why is Zion not here? Hold on, did I overlook it again just like Jalen Brown? No. Why is Zion not on this list? You're not about to cheat me out of potentially getting Zion on my team. Oh wait, maybe he's not from South Carolina, but he went to school in South Carolina. That's high school in South Carolina. All right, all right, you're lucky. You're lucky. So it is nine different players. I need the number seven. Nine different players. Give me seven. Give me seven. I got eight, which is Aaron Nee Smith, which is not bad. But John Morant was one pick away, so it does it does hurt. But I like Aaron Nee Smith. We have only one big, and that's Marvin Bagley, by the way. So we need to get something right so we can get a big. Oh, all right. Again, this could be almost any place. <laughs> um, Law? That's Law Drive? Oh, okay, all right. Oh, man, I can't wait to read the comments about that reference. This looks like Texas to me. I'm sorry. So many things look like Texas to me, but this looks like Texas to me, man. This looks like Texas to me. Um, I wonder. Okay, so this is somewhat of a main road. Can we go down this main road in one of the two directions? Let's go this direction. I think I see stores. I think I see stores. I think I feel I feel like this is gonna be Texas or one of the neighboring states. We have not got a good neighboring state thing yet, have we? Wait, or did we? And I just didn't capitalize. All right, either way, I don't care. I don't care. That's not important right now. Sports clips. That's universal though. Okay, okay. That might be what all I need to know, but it doesn't tell me anything. You know, sometimes these street signs have like the city or state logo on it. Um. Oh, that actually might. Oh, what my glasses that I can't read that. I think I've been taking too much time. I think I'm just gonna have to take my guess. And I do believe this is probably like Texas or something. I'm guessing Texas. I know we've guessed a lot of Texas today. And that's why, cause it, not Texas. It's not Texas. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a neighboring state. It was Oklahoma City. Wow, we were we were right down the street from downtown OKC. All right, it's a neighboring state though. So this is this is okay. This is okay. It's a, it's a slight W. Now I don't know any NBA players that are from Oklahoma. So let's see. Um, I said I put five on a list. There's only six. So I'm a, I'm just gonna do randomizer one through six. That's why I make a full wheel for six players. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Number four, Josh Richardson. Again, not a bad pickup whatsoever, but we have yet to get a center outside of Bagley. 
and we are eight out of our 14 spots so we need to figure it out soon reminder if you are enjoying the video leave it a like man leave it a like oh oh my god what does it say it's a church of who it's a church of who now the church may not tell you what state we in um but it might tell you some okay it tell us the founders temple yeah no it's just the temple all right that's doesn't tell me nothing um okay the right the the hardest thing to do is to figure out what direction you should go i'm going this way i see an expressway and that could tell me something maybe like maybe there's a sign that say keep keep this way to get to next major city and the next major city might be something i know so let me go down the street i think that was a very good thought process um in practice it doesn't look like it's working too much okay um okay here's another street sign let's see if we can get something off the street sign um no what did this sign say hold on back it up back it up back it up this sign says bike route and houston bike away <laughs> are we back in houston are we back in houston please tell me we are houston houston texas come on man i'm not one to complain but we've got an insane amount of texas in this video and i'm not mad at it because it's easier all right so we got jimmy butler tyrese maxi julius randall as options jimmy butler is the smartest option but we also have no forwards and no power forwards no center so miles turner is there is that stupid i'm just gonna take the best player available and let the work the rest be the rest jimmy butler welcome to the team we'll figure out the rest later man we we're gonna get centers but i can't pass up on a 90 plus overall player under any circumstance so jimmy's on the squad here we go last round or last guess of this round um blair avenue okay let's see what these signs say it just it just tells us some stuff about the construction company cajun meats now hiring laborers which way do we go which way do we go um i'm gonna go this way because it looks like there's more businesses this way all we need is for one of these businesses to say whatever city um whatever city plumbers you know, that's all we need. That's all we need. Oh, man. This is going to be just a shot in the dark. It's going to have to be a shot in the dark and hope that we get like a neighboring city or a neighboring state because I'm not getting nothing. The more I go down, the less optimistic I feel about this. State machinery. What state? Oh, the bus might be able to tell us something. Rental car shuttle. Oh, my God. Louis Armstrong nor New Orleans. New Orleans airport. Oh my God. Oh my God. Louisiana, baby. I've never been to New Orleans, but I got that right, baby. I've never been to New Orleans, but I got that right. Come on, y'all. Louisiana NBA players. Again, if you are enjoying yourself, you got to leave a like as I am stupidly locked in. I just got Jimmy Butler on my team. I'm stupidly locked in. Who's from Louisiana? De'Aaron Fox, Thad uh, Thaddeus Young, Robert Williams, Bro, we don't need another guard. Right now, our guards are Donovan Mitchell, Trey Young. We don't need another guard. But, like, why Why would I pass up on De'Aaron Fox even for, for Robert Williams? De'Aaron, welcome to the team, bro. Welcome to the team. I will get a big eventually. I swear. Perfect. Another instance where I thought we bodied the game. You are now a master tourist. Well done. You've gained a little title. That's my character. I didn't create it. But that's my character. All right. Okay. We only get a couple more. So, we... This looks like tech. This is Texas. <laughs> this looks like Texas again, bro. I swear to you, this looks like Texas again to me. Um, this this you know what this reminds me of? When I was in um I was in Arlington, Texas, to be exact. This this is what that remind me of. And and we're in the burbs or in a neighborhood district, and that's not gonna tell us a lot unless there's somebody that's like got a, a longhorns flag in their front yard or something that's the only way we can confirm it but um yeah i don't know i'm, I'm a ho ho hook em. longhorn sting in the front yard can i can i make this up are we on the easiest i just said it i just said that this was about to happen hook em horns i guess um now the question is i have no idea where I just need to get the state right. I have no idea where actual University of Texas is. Is it in Fort Worth? I have no idea. Brother, I was down the street, basically. That's insane. Another Texas. Another Texas. Another Texas. What? Now, no, I don't care who's left. I'm picking a center now. At this point, I have to get a center. And I don't even remember who was on the list, even though we've been to Texas a thousand times. Um, the best center. Oh, Alice Caruso's here, though. Kate Cunningham is here, though. 
It's going to be Miles Turner. I'm going to take my shot with Miles Turner as our center. You cannot make it up. I said the only way we will know is if someone had a hook em horn sign in their front yard, and they literally did. Oh, oh, can we get this without moving? Can we get this without moving? No, it's a little league park. That dang. Somebody go fix this park, man. Let the kids play some baseball. We got grass all around it, man. But it's, that might even be the city. That don't tell me enough, though. I don't know that. Uh, this, what, what is, what is my first impression? My first impression is like, like, oof. Actually, I don't know. Hold on. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Did I see a clue? Did I see a clue? Another thing you can look for on all of this is looking for the political sign. Like this guy is running for office for something. Tom, for a district judge. But never mind. It don't tell us what district. Okay, never mind. But that, those are the type of things I'm looking for. That That is a really good sign um, that I feel good that we're going to eventually get there. Especially now that we're pulling up on some 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 actual places. 215 area code or 215 area code red signs. That don't tell me anything, even though it, it should. Uh, a memorial. Montgomery County. Montgomery County. Yikes. Yeah, I don't know, bro. Montgomery County. Dang, that should be enough. There's people yelling at the screen right now because they know exactly what, where we're at. I don't know. Uh, I can't spend too much time. I'm going to have to take a shot and hope that I get a neighboring state. Um, I'm going down two more clicks. Go down two more clicks. Let's look at our surrounding. There's a tavern there. Doesn't tell me anything. Um, auto tags, Pennsylvania. Oh my God. Oh my God. Let's say we're near Pittsburgh. We were on the other side. We we're closer to Philly. I don't care. We got the state right. That's all like, right, 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 right. That's, 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 yeah. We got the state right. Now I will say, I've been guessing all with under like a minute, a minute and a half. And I can prove that. I can prove that. You feel me? Um, Mikhail Bridges is the guy. Mikhail Bridges, welcome to the team. We only get two more. Only two more. And, and we'll, we'll see. We'll see if we can stack up another big. So far, I am shooting a ridiculous percentage of figuring out what state we in. I will say that. I am, I am like just going crazy right now. Um, let's get to the street here. Let's look at these signs. Let's look at these signs. So we are on, what the heck does that say? Con Hoken State Road. That sounds like a place in Boston. That's, they, I don't know why. That sounds like we in uh, Massachusetts or something. I might just take that guess because that's the vibes I just got from that one street name. Um, yeah, I don't think we're going to get any of the signs unless somebody literally has a sign that says like, UMass. Imagine it happened again. No, I because we're such in a residential area. I'm going to have to take my guess. Oh, wait, wait. Tell me something. Tell me something. Doesn't tell me nothing. What the heck? Who wrapped that, that, that house? All right, I'm taking the guess. I'm saying we're somewhere in Boston again. That's the only thing. Only vibes I'm getting off this. Um, Boston, Massachusetts. And we are in Pittsburgh. Oh, Philadelphia? Near Philadelphia again? What the heck? What just happened? So, oh, yeah. So, we are in Pennsylvania again. Back-to-back -back Pennsylvanias. Those places, our last two places are within, like, two miles of each other, which is insane. So, we got to get a randomizer, which is okay. Can't expect me to shoot 100%. Now, there are 17 active NBA players from the state. 17. Let's see if we can get... A good player. We're getting player number 13. And that will be Markeith Morris. All right. I'll take Markeith. This right here is our last one until the secret round, which we'll talk about once we cross that bridge. All right. So this tells me this immediate scene. I got zero, zero clues um, altogether. So we got to pick a direction. I'm picking this way. Based on what? Nothing really. Just hopes that we get good vibes. Uh-oh. Let's go a little bit this way. Hold on. Did you tell me something? Did you tell me something? Long Island Dentistry. Long Island, New York again? Long Island, New York again? Yes. <laughs> New York, thank you. Now we need to get a big from New York this time. And then we're gonna get to the, the secret round. Um, we need a big though. Let's get a big. Mo Bamba, Thomas Bryant, Andre Drummond. Andre Drummond is the best big here. I'm taking drum gun. I'm gonna take drum. The last round, this is what we gotta do. We're going to place ourselves. Well, I mean, play, let them place us. We have 15 seconds with no moving to take a guess. If I get it right, I can pick any player in basketball to add to my team. Are we ready? Cannot move. 15 seconds based on this. Um, 
15 seconds, cannot move, can't even look around. Uh, and I have to get the state completely. Okay, I don't have enough. We just have to take a random guess and pray that we're right. I'm going to say because we have got zero California, I'm going to play the odds and say we're in SoCal. Even though I see nothing that says SoCal. I would have never got Utah. You know what? I would have never got Utah. All right, our team is set. We're going to throw them into K and we're going to figure out is that team good enough to win a championship? I'm actually surprised we didn't get it. I don't think we got a single California. You know, Cali got all the players. I was just hoping to get one California and get it right. But we're the Kansas City Knights, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, the team has one, two, three, four, five all star level players. Of course, De'Aaron to make it this year, but you know what I mean. Um, right now, the starting lineup has Royce O'Neal starting. I don't love that. I mean, Jimmy can run four, right? I know it's overall going to drop. Let's see how much it drops as a four. By one, Jimmy, you're a four. And Mikael Bridges, you're a three. Boom. Our new starting lineup. I'm, I'm sorry to Royce O'Neal. You're done. You're out of the rotation, buddy. We don't need that. So now the team looks like that. Oh, they want to put Trey Young in the starting lineup. I don't really care how the, start, the guards start. I mean, we were talking about four all-star caliber guards. I mean, you pick and choose who starts and who doesn't. This is 100% a championship team, right? 100% a championship team, right? I think it's 100% a championship team. Oh, I really wanted to get that that um free space. I would have added Jokic to this team. If I would have got that right with the no movements, I would have added Jokic. And it I, now that I look back on that, me guessing California was the worst possible thing. We uh, we went 10-0 or something before we lost. It was the worst possible thing. There was nothing that gave the feeling of California. I was kind of going off body mass. You know what I'm saying? California is one of the bigger states, so the likelihood of we landed in California is kind of high. Instead, it was Utah. And again, not a single person would have guessed Utah unless you live in that exact street. That's how I feel. But the boys look great. You know what I'm saying? I was thinking, hmm, should we do a rebuild? What rebuild is to be done? What we gonna trade De'Aaron Fox and and uh, who else is on the team? Mouse Turner for. Jokic for Embiid? No, right? No, there's no rebuild that needs to be done. This team is a winner. And all of that was because of me. Because I don't think we got I don't think we got lucky. I think I picked Donovan Mitchell. I picked Trey Young. I put Jimmy Butler, De'Aaron Fox, Miles Bridges, and Mikael Bridges. I mean my Miles Turner and Mikael Bridges. So I picked all of the good players. Every time we got it wrong, we got a role player. I was gonna say something negative, but a role player. So I really just just took Geo Gesser and became a pro. We next time we run Geo Gesser in two years again, because every two years is a tradition at this point. We making the rules harder for me. Has to be in less than 20 seconds or something. I don't know. Because we got locked. We got lucky some too, but we also got locked. It was the greatest team ever constructed in the history of basketball. What can I say? And I'm not just making that. I'm not just making that up. Uh, what team are we? We're what team are we? The Knights. Oh, I did change the name. Um, but oh. <laughs> The greatest regular season team in the history of basketball. I don't get one All-NBA player. 75-win team. 75. Like, come on, man. Come on, man. I don't, that ain't a team. That's rocking. That, that's messing with us. 21 points per game. Almost 50, 40, 90 for Donovan Mitchell. 16 points per game. 62% from the field for Jimmy Butler, by the way. that's He's a center. Those are center. And he also shot 40. What? He I can't even comp compute. He was a few free throws away from the 60-40-90 club. Is there a single player in history that's 60, 40, 90? I don't think there is. I don't think there is. Uh, Trey Young, close to 50, 40, 90. Uh, Anthony Edwards, close to 50, 40, 90. De'Aaron Fox, not very close to 50, 40, 90. But boys, girls, you know what this team is going to do. I didn't think we were going to be that good, but here we are. All right. First round, we're going against the Pistons. Shout out to the Pistons. Okay. All right, Pistons fans. Look at you making the playoffs in my video. Uh, and you even took a game from the best team in regular season history. So congratulations. Second round, we go against a really, really, really good team. Um, we're better, though. Point guard, shooting guard. That's it. We got the more depth, I hope. Game one is a win. Game two is a win. Oh. Oh, okay. That's simple. That's like word. We're in the conference finals to go against the Indiana Pacers, who have Gabe Vincent at the two. So they made a trade. They traded for Vooch. I need to see what that trade looks like. Oh, my God. Is that a trade that can pull off in real life? Please, I need something. I need some type of Bulls trade. It was Vooch for Nimhar. I would do this in a heartbeat. Now, the Pacers wouldn't, but I would do this in a heartbeat because we took away Mouse Turn for them, so they needed a center. So that's why they tried. Oh, all right. Okay, Pascal and Halley ended up with a six double-doubles. All right, congratulations to y'all for winning the game. But that's when we shut the, we shut the water off. <laughs> we shut the water off to go to the fighters to go against... Zion and the Pels. 
The Pels make any starting trades? Nope. Same starting five. Shout out to them from the four seed all the way to, ooh, winning the game one. Why are we losing game ones all of a sudden? And we get out of there in five. Ladies and gentlemen, Jimmy Butler is an MVP, um, and he was 60-50-92 in the actual finals. Now, that was a ton of fun. If you have any other um, I, a, a game that we can play and attach an NBA player to an NBA switch to it, let me know in the comment section, baby. I need it. The 2K is not very good, so I like to play other stuff to make it good. All right. I appreciate y'all, and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.